Hello, my name is Connor, and today I'll be talking about the physics behind a football tackle. Here comes the, here comes the, here comes the, y'all don't really want it like that. Yeah. Here comes the, no. here comes the, oh. here comes the, y'all don't really want it like that. As you watch football, you may see a huge tackle by a defender and this is usually called a bull rush. A bull rush is a direct and forceful hit on an offensive player. One of the best bull rushers out there is a man named Ray Lewis and he used to play for the Baltimore Ravens. Ray Lewis was one of the most fearful players to ever play football. As you may see in the picture, he's performing a nasty hit. There's a lot more behind this hit. Newton's second law plays a huge role in this hit also. Newton's second law states that the acceleration of an object produced by a force acts on a mass. So the greater the mass of the player, the greater force is produced. So if Ray Lewis weighs 250 pounds or 113 kilograms and hits a player going 58.86 meters per second, he creates a force of 6,651 newtons, which newtons is the SI unit for force. The 6,651 newtons of force is enough to break human bones and you only need 4,000 newtons to fracture a bone. Ray Lewis's hit has another 2,000 newtons of force, which can cause more damage. Now, let's go into more detail of what a force is. A force is a push or pull of an object. The force can cause an object to start or stop moving or change directions. And usually in football, these massive hits make players change directions. In the world, there are two forces, contact forces and field forces. In the game of football, contact force is the main force. Now, a contact force is a force that arises from physical contact of two objects. This is usually an applied force. To show a better example, let's look at this free body diagram. The diagram shows how the applied force acts from player 1 to player 2. As you can see, player 1 has more mass than player 2, which player 1 would be changing the direction of player 2 and sending him backwards. In the diagram, it also shows the gravity of each player and the, and the normal force. Since player 1 weighs more than player 2, player 1 is going to have more gravity, normal force, and applied force. Which means player 1 is going to have, more for, have a more forceful hit. Whether if it's a contact force or a field force, these forces play a role in our everyday life. If you're ever thinking about doing a bull rush, just think of Newton's second law and how much force you can hit someone with. Throughout the video, I hoped you learned that force is a push or a pull of an object. Force can be contact in field, and more importantly, how force plays a vital role in football so that a defender can make a tackle and the player can't score a touchdown. The next time you are watching a football game, just think about Newton's second law. F equals MA, or force equals mass times acceleration. Thank you for watching my video behind the physics of a hard tackle. Work it, make it, do it, makes us older, better, faster, stronger. Not, 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 that, that don't kill me, can only make us stronger. Stronger. Man, I've been waiting all night now. That's how long I've been on ya.